I am here today in uh, uh, Lower Marsh, Waterloo, and uh, the market here has been here now for five months. And Waterloo is like many areas around a station where people rush in and they rush out and they focus on the station, on getting to or coming back from somewhere. And that can leave the surrounding area rather neglected. And it should be an area which has that feel of somewhere where you can come into. Now we've seen that happen all over London. One of the things we have in, in contemporary society which is a big problem is people's lack of a sense of community. And once you lose that, people don't feel empowered. They don't feel empowered to control their streets. They don't feel that they're in control even within their own homes. And, and that's very bad for us. We want to feel part of a community and empowered within our community. So we're here, Prince Charles is coming here to Lower Marsh and he's going to have a look at the market and hear about the work that the foundation has done with the local community. Then we go on for the annual conference of what was the Prince's Foundation for the Built Environment and is now the Prince's Foundation for Building Communities. The change in the name is really about the name having an, a, a tangible explanation in its title of what it does. The Prince's Foundation for the Built Environment doesn't actually tell you what it does. The Prince's Foundation for Building Communities tells you exactly what it does. And that is the only reason for the name change. It's about clarifying the work that the Foundation does.